if square root of a plus ib is equal to x plus i y then possible value of square root of a minus ib so given square root of a plus ib which is equal to x plus i y so this can also be written a plus ib which is equal to x plus i y whole square now applying mod on both the sides take modulus on both the sides So we have mod of a plus ib which is equal to modulus of x plus iy whole square. So this can also be written mod of a plus ib is equal to mod of x plus iy whole square. Since modulus of z power n which is same as mod z whole power n for n is an integer. Now also we have modulus of z is equal to modulus of z bar means conjugate and is equal to modulus of minus z also. So let us use this concept mod z is equal to mod of z bar. So we can write the conjugate of a plus ib can also be taken modulus of a plus ib its conjugate which is equal to modulus of x plus iy conjugate whole square. So which in turn, so modulus of a minus a plus ib is conjugate of a plus ib can be taken a minus ib which is equal to modulus of x minus iy whole square or we can write a minus ib is equal to modulus of a minus ib is equal to modulus of x minus iy whole square or we can write a minus ib is equal to x minus iy whole square or square root of a minus ib is equal to x minus iy so we can simply change the sign of minus so root of a minus ib is equal to x minus iy so which is our fourth option okay please like share subscribe and support us Thank you.